such a good yes. I started rewatching it's always sunny have you watched euphoria <clears throat> no I have not watched euphoria I don't I know what it's about yeah anyway. I don't either so everybody keeps talking about it right it? Feel like it's uh, Zendaya like a plays like a drug flick, addict just look that it's up. dark and but she's like a, a teenager she's like 17 but she's addicted to yeah, pills and it, shit it's like a coming of age kind of television show right yeah but like yeah. a super fucked up version of it I heard it was supposed to be like the 13 of this generation I just have time to watch it's, TV. It's like a shit. dark drama. I like go home from and work and just TV watch TV. TV. I know Zendaya's in it. That's all I know about it. That's yeah, she she's been nominated for like two Emmys off of that show. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. The I, the other thing and that as a, I've been like that type of drug addict before. <laughs> I've never seen anyone that does it as oh, good so as, it's, as her. Yeah, because it's like a drug thing. Yeah, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah like, but she also she like suffers really from good. depression and shit. So, because like, have you seen the movie Thirteen? I don't, I don't think know. so. Thirteen uh, going on thirty? No, that well, was maybe. did Mark Ruffalo? No, Mark Gar- thirteen Gar- Ruffalo. Is a fucking uncomfortable movie, dude. It's fucking weird, bro. <laughs> I mean, is it like Spawn? No, it's like it's Euphoria. Like apparently, it's like know? these two little girls who start like exploring drugs and having sex and all this, and like you follow one who went from like being a good girl to fucking around with this little crazy mexican girl who taught her how to do all kinds of crazy shit like it's fucking crazy dude. it's it's uncomfortable like i always was i was always uncomfortable watching that movie you know that's how i, I mean? felt with euphoria too it's it's, uh, it's it, an uncomfortable it gives me show bad anxiety <laughs> yeah and you know like there's nothing wrong with that when you watch something you know what i mean but yeah, it, yeah. It, it's it's also one of those ones where I, it makes me like hesitant to watch it because it's like fuck. I don't, <laughs> you don't want to watch it but you want to know what yeah, happened yeah you know what i mean yeah, like yeah. I don't Another like that. thing I just found out about that show, uh, the girl that plays Lexi is Judd Apatow's daughter. <coughs> oh, <nice. Sorry>. yeah. <laughs> Maude Apatow. <laughs> Maude Apatow. Is he that directed, really uh, her name? Yeah, Maude Apatow. He directed uh, Knocked Up, fucking... Like forgetting Sarah Marshall. A lot of those Seth, uh, Seth, of Seth Rogen, Rogen movies. Rogen, yeah, a lot of Seth Rogen movies. Yeah, he was he was like the new age Happy Madison for a while there. Yeah. Super bad, right? Didn't he do super bad? And they tried to cancel the. Uh, fuck, who was it? Who was he super against? I don't know. You tell me. I'm trying to remember. Remember. Huh. This uh, but the the best person in Euphoria is a uh, shout out to Sydney Sweeney. Yeah. Yeah. Totally. Yeah, she plays. Uh, <laughs> yeah. She plays Lexi's sister. She's okay. Yeah, she, she sucks <laughs> good dicks. <laughs> she basically send, spends like the whole two seasons crying, and she's <laughs> pretty good at doing a crying scene. Ah oh, man, it it must be hard being an actress that has to cry so much during a show. Ah oh, man, like. It's got to be hard on them. You know what I mean? Because yeah. they, they don't just use the first take. A, you know what I mean? Is Zendaya in a Euphoria? She a does lot. it real well. Yeah, that was probably like one of her harder harder roles compared to what she did in the past with like Disney and like Spider Man and shit. But when it comes to an emotional like drama, she's really good, really good in that show. I mean, she always seemed like a great actor. Yeah, really, yeah. you know, like there's I, I mean, I guess I don't necessarily know what makes a good actor, but from what I know <laughs> as a a, you know, watcher of movies and TV, <laughs> she seems great to me. Yeah. You yeah know? In, in my opinion, if you could do a cry scene good, you're a good actor. Like, see, uh, was it the dude that played Shaggy in the Scooby Doo movies? But his cry scene at the end of SLC Punk when Bob dies. Oh yeah. Oh, I never seen That's that movie. I, I know what you're talking about. You've never though. seen SLC Punk? I, no, I never seen the full movie, but I know exactly what it's about. I know the whole story and everything. 